Down here with Quinn Amiel. So how was the bus ride down? That was a great bus ride. Mo slept for most of it, had a nice meal, and now we're here, getting ready to go. Tell me about what it's like being one of the newer players on the team. Uh, coming into Christmas time last year, it was a little awkward coming into a team, full team that already knew each other, but guys were really nice, brought me in really quickly, picked up the system nice and fast. So yeah, it was, it was actually pretty fun. Could you tell me a little bit about the team chemistry inside the Vikings dressing room? This is probably one of the tightest teams I've been on in a long, long time. Like everyone just, a lot of guys have played together in the past, so that helps. And just everyone's come together so fast at the start of the year. It was actually pretty fun. Who would you say are the players to watch tonight? Always have to watch out for Tori Dick and Dan Hope. They're my line mates and they just make everything so easy for me. And our goalie, Paul Kalita, has stepped in at Christmas time. He used to play for Portage and he's been a huge addition to our team in net. And then we have our grinding line, which really takes down top line. They do every night, so yeah. What do you do to make sure that the Vikings are known as a better team than the Trojans? I just don't give them too much respect. They're the three-time defending champions. You can't go into a series thinking about that, and that's going to be your focus, because then, of course, you are going to lose. So you just got to be physical on them, take the body, and like I said, don't give them too much respect and just believe that you can beat them.